At saka, ano ba yung... Kaya. <laughs> Jumbo, <laughs> hotdog. Kaya, kaya mo ba to? Oh, oh, marami ano tayong ngayon? tanong from our viewers. Thank you for liking and subscribing to our channel. At dahil bilang may mga tanong kayo, uh-huh. kailangan naming sagutin. Uh-huh. <laughs> ito, unang question. Ito, kailangan bang one-time investment sa mutual fund o every month ako mag-invest? Uh, depende doon sa financial goal niya. <laughs> okay. okay. Sige. So, bakit ka ba mag invest Oo, tama, tama, okay. tama. So, for example, ang goal ko ay magkaroon ng isang million after mm. 10 years. Mm. So, ang tanong ngayon is, paano kung magagawa yun? Basta ang bottom line mo, in 10 years time, may 1 million ka. Oo. Oo. So, ang tanong ngayon is, ma-achieve ko ba yun sa pamamagitan ng pag-i-invest ng one time? Oo, oh, ma, pamamagitan. Ah. Oo. Sige. Can I, one time? Can I re- reach that goal? Oo. Or, can I reach that goal by investing every month? Okay. okay. Oh. So, may ginawa kang computation kanina. Oh. Kita ko eh. Dahil may ginawa kang computation. Okay. For example, in ten, kung gusto man ng 1 million in 10 years time, sabi ng stock market kasi long term eh. No? Oh. Tapos average 10%. Okay? Year, oh. Kung gusto mo ng one time payment, kailangan mo maglabas ng 385.5 thousand. Oh, one time. One time. So, yung 385.5 thousand, 385k mo, at 10% per year, after 10 years, may 1 million ka na. Oh, okay. okay. Or, so ang tanong dyan is, may 385,000 ka na ba? Okay. Na ready na dyan. Oh, Kasi kung wala pa, then magmamanti ka. Okay. So, for you to get the same amount of 1M in 10 years time, you just need to invest 4,882 pesos per month oh, oh. for the next 10 years in an investment giving 10% on the average per year for the next 10 years, may 1 million ka. Ah, so... Pag uh, meron na akong 385,000 ngayon, pwede na one time. Hindi ko na kailangan monthly. Monthly. Oh, Invest ko na ngayon one time. Yes. Ngayon, so, naipon ka. Kung wala naman, oh, oh. and I think I can afford na uh, 4,800 every month. Every month. Yun yung gagawin ko every mm-hmm. month. Kasi ang reason niyan again is Ano bang kaya mo? At saka ano ba yung kaya? <laughs> Jumbo, <laughs> hotdog. Kaya, kaya mo ba to? Cut. <laughs> Ang goal niyan ay magkaroon ng 1 million after, after 10, 10 years. years. So again, um, that's the bottom line. Para sa akin, ha, mm. I mean, monthly ba o one time? Basta bottom line, at the end of 10 years, may maka, maka one time. Tsaka marami kasing style ng pag invest mm. Ang style ng pag invest mo, ang mag determine kung ano yun is yung goal mo. Yeah. What is the best way to achieve your financial yeah. goal? Kaya nga ang tawag sa kanila is investment vehicle. Because, uh-huh. di ba, vehicle, sasakyan mo. So, kumbaga, <laughs> sasakyan <laughs> kita. <laughs> uh-huh. So, kumbaga, the investment vehicle should get you there to your destination. Kaya uh-huh. nga tawag sa kanila investment vehicle. Okay. Okay. Yan. Okay. So, next question. Next question. Okay. In relation to that, okay, ilang stocks ba ang dapat hawak for a long-term portfolio? Ah, uh, sa akin, usually mga 3 to 5. 3 is to okay. 5? Mm-hmm. Kasi pag 10, dapat nag mutual fund ka na lang or nag UITF, 'di ba? Ang dapat nag equity fund ka na lang. No? Oh, tama naman, tama naman. Sa akin naman, uh, it's not wala kong ready na how many stocks. Mas mm-hmm. ako again, yung parang pinag-usapan natin kanina, whether 1, 3 or 5 stocks, basta yung mix ng stocks na yun. Like, kunare yung ginawa natin, 10%, di ba, per year. Mm-hmm. So, dapat, whether you go for 1, 3 or 5 or even 10 stocks, dapat, on the average, pag pinagsama-sama sila lahat, Ang gain dapat, niya ay mga 10%. 10% ka per year. Oh, so, so, dun, papasok yung minamanage mo yung stock portfolio ko. Portfolio management na yun. Yeah. Ang tawag dun is weighted return. Maybe we can do a video about that. Basta dapat, whether, uh, sa akin lang, no, whether you go for one, how many stocks that you would be having, yeah, dapat at least 10, pag pinagsama-sama sila, dapat maka 10% sila mm. for you. For your financial good. But I've read some articles nga from the states na 3 to 5 stocks would be good. Oh, kasi una-una, madaling i-monitor kasi mga 3 to 5 lang, di ba? Yun nga, kasi may mga nakita ko 20 yung stocks nila. So, ko, ano to, gumagawa ka ba ng equity fund? <laughs> Sarili mong equity <laughs> fund, di ba? Saka remember, ha, pag pinagsama-sama mo na lahat yan, for example, 
isa dyan umakit ng 20%. Okay, kunwari naghahabol tayo ng 10, di ba? Yung isa dyan umakit ng 20, pero yung isa dyan bumababa ng 40, halimbawa. Uh-oh. So, nahihila niya yung pababa, di ba? So, naghihilahan niya along the way. So, manage your portfolio as well. Alright, so last question. Last question, is it okay to top up in a down market? Especially right now, no? Medyo... Oh, down ng market. Oh, uh, okay ba mag-top up? Ako? Oo, kasi lalo na kapag ka down market, no, you get more shares uh, with your stock or mutual fund and you get more units with your UITFs. Although, ako naman, from if you would be savvier about it, titingnan mo rin kung yung pinapasukan mong stock would, again, maganda pa rin yung outlook niya. Uh-uh. Kasi baka mamaya, down market, tapos yung stock na hawak mo or yung fan hawak mo is underperforming or kunari, stock ang pag-usapan natin, eh, palugi na pala yung company. Like, You know, before sunny wears. Hindi ko na naabutan yan. Hindi ko magawa na toilet bowl. Ah, okay. Naka ano yan, nasa stock market yan. Ngayon, wala na siya. So, uh, ang assumption dito is you are investing for the long term. Mm-hmm. Tapos down market. Ang tanong, mm-hmm. magta-top up ka ba? Ang sagot natin ay, maganda mag-top up kasi down. So, you will be oh. able to buy more shares. Pero, hindi ka basa-basa magta-top up. Doon sa existing Hindi ka mo. bara-bara. Titingnan mo din yung pagtatapapan mo. Kung okay ba tong uh, hawak ko ngayon or baka may ibang stock or mutual fund or UITF na mm-hmm. maganda yung long-term outlook. Oo. So, isa na mag-top-up ka, you just buy a new uh, uh, company or uh, buy, buy invest in a new uh, mutual fund or Oo. UITF. Kasi pagdating sa shares of stock, kunwari lahat down, di ba? May tinatawag kasi na valuation eh. Oo. Pwedeng down sila lahat tapos kumbaga mura tong stock na to eh kung mas mura to oo so, at saka yung outlook mas sa outlook. mas maganda yung outlook so kunwari isa. parehong parehong down mura mas mura pero mas maganda yung outlook halimbawa nito kesa dito kunwari uh, mura mas mura ito upside nito 10% lang eh ito mas mura na pero ang potential niya sabi natin mga 15% oo oo yeah. so pag uh, nahihirapan sila na mag-analyze <laughs> ng mga oh, investments, nandito kami. Nandito kami. So, we, oh. that's actually yung portfolio management. That's yeah. uh, one of the services oh. that we provide. Oh. We don't just look at the, a particular stock, but we look at your portfolio as a whole. How And the uh, consideration uh, yung financial goals nila. No? Yes, yeah. so, that's true. So, if you'd like to know more of our services, you can visit our website, wealtharchy.com. And our Facebook page also. You Wealth can Archie. also send an email sa admin at wealtharchy.com for your questions. And yeah. I guess that's it no? for yeah. our Q&A episode. That's it. That's it. Uh, so share this video to your friends. And like. Uh, give it a like, thumbs up, and subscribe. do subscribe to our YouTube channel. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.